the tiger is pretty much the ultimate symbol of fighting power. Just think of all the people named after this amazing creature. There's Tiger Woods, World War I French President George Clemenceau, he was named the Tiger, and then there's Tony the Tiger. Frosted Flakes, good. They're great. All the heroes in their field, whether golf, war, or cereal. What makes the tiger so tough? Big teeth, big paws, and amazing camouflage for a start. But is it really the toughest animal in the world? Maybe not. We're going to take a look at some of the contenders. From the snake that likes to cuddle tightly to the other big cat, here's 15 animals that could defeat a tiger. <sighs> Number 15. Anaconda The anaconda is a massive, super huge snake that lives in the Amazon rainforest. These snakes have a notorious reputation, like a lot of stuff from the South American jungle, and have had a Hollywood adventure horror film made about them, 1997's Anaconda. If you ever wanted to see Jennifer Lopez covered in monkey blood and squeezed almost to death by a giant angry snake, this is the film for you. Although real anacondas are not basically indestructible and able to outwit human beings, even Jennifer Lopez, like in the films, they are still extremely dangerous animals. Some reports suggest that they can grow to as much as 100 feet in length, and while it's more common for jaguars to eat them, they also have been known to kill jaguars, so if this big snake can take down a jaguar, then maybe one day it will run into a tiger in some zoo and be able to defeat him. Especially Especially if it's in water. Anaconda means great swimmer, and these snakes are masters of H2O. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or Slenderman will come from under your bed when you're sleeping. Number 14. Lion. One of the oldest questions in the history of the internet is, who would win in a fight? Tiger or lion? These two cats are the mightiest creatures on land, and very evenly matched. The tiger is the bigger animal and more intelligent, but that doesn't mean the lion doesn't have plenty of strengths. Due to humans killing millions of the animals, lions and tigers no longer live in the same parts of the world. But once their territories overlapped, and no doubt encounters would have happened. Where does the lion have strength? First of all, it has immensely strong paws, which are connected to a huge mass of muscles knotted into its back. It has better defense than the tiger, with the mane covering its neck from attacks. Finally, the lion is known for its heart. They just will not give up or lie down. And plus, lions live in prides and fight one another often, while tigers are solitary, and so get less practice against against other big cats. But the tiger's brains and a massive bite force count for a lot. They will bite through the spinal cord and disable the lion, while the lion keeps going for the head. Number 13. Elephants Elephants are the biggest land animals in the world, so it's no surprise that they are no pushovers in a fight. In Asia, elephants and tigers meet quite often, and the results are usually not great for the tigers. Most of the conflict comes from tigers trying to opportunistically hunt baby elephants as prey, but a baby elephant and a full-grown adult Asian elephant are not the same thing at all. And if the tiger gets a little too overconfident, it's going to have to deal with an angry monster charging it down. Elephants are super protective of their young and will fearlessly attack anything that dares to threaten them, something that tigers have to be extra careful of. In fact, knowing the threat, elephants will sometimes randomly attack tigers, which has caused tiger populations to move into areas free of elephants for their own safety. This one's an easy call. Adult elephant wins against the tiger every time. Those kicks and tusks and the massive weight of a truck charging through the forest is just too formidable, even for these big cats. Number 12. Crocodile 
You would think life as an apex predator would be a breeze, but not in a world where a bunch of other animals are staking their claim as apex predator too. For example, the crocodile. This prehistoric killing machine is one of the most successful predators of all time, evolving around 55 million years ago. They are reptiles and live in warm and wet areas, such as the mangrove area of the Sundarban in India. Another species that lives in the Sundarbans is the tiger. And according to local news reports, these two species have been locked in a battle for supremacy over the territory. The Sundarban Tiger Reserve sent a patrol party out in August 2011 to see how their tigers were getting on, and they were met with an all-too-familiar sight, a dead and mutilated tiger. They assumed it was the usual case, human poachers, but this time it seemed poachers were not to blame, as they found multiple crocodile tooth marks in the tiger's body, and it seems the tiger's legs had been ripped off and eaten. So for now, the croc remains the king of the mangrove swamps, not the tiger. Number 11. Sloth Bear Things aren't getting much better for the tigers away from the swamps either. In Dudwa National Park, Indian researchers found the remains of a tiger at a waterhole. After checking the park's camera traps, they spotted a likely culprit, a sloth bear which was pretty beat up and limping, kind of like it had just done several rounds of battle with the tiger. A similar incident occurred at a separate park in Tadoba, suggesting that when these two face off for dominance of a waterhole, it's not good news for the tiger. Sloth bears might sound cute and slow, but they are anything but. These Indian bears are fierce, with huge claws and teeth. They feed mainly on termites, ants, and fruit, but that doesn't seem to have made them any less ferocious, and they have just what it takes to make a tiger's life a misery. Their thick fur means it's almost impossible for a tiger to get a grip on this bear, and so while it's a close match, the sloth bear seems to have the upper hand for now. Number 10. Gar The gar is a truly massive animal, a total muscle monster. In fact, it is the largest of all species of wild cattle, and it lives in Asia. Their bodies grow up to 10 foot 10 inches, and they can stand 7 3 at the shoulder, towering over almost any man that ever lived. Big males can weigh an astonishing 3,300 pounds. To a meat-eating predator, this might look like a four-legged steakhouse moving about the forest, but this restaurant is anything but open for business. These animals are considered among the most dangerous in all of the forests of Asia, even more than the tiger. Tigers will sometimes try and ambush, and amazingly given their 2,500 pound size disadvantage, are sometimes successful. But often gars will chase away the big cats, even gouging and killing tigers in self-defense. These horns are not just for display. As you can see in this video, the tiger takes one look at this solid lump of beef and decides to run for it rather than get into a tangle it might live to regret. Luckily for the tiger, gars are pretty rare these days their numbers having reached critical levels thanks to poaching and habitat destruction. Number 9. Grizzly Bear The grizzly lives a long, long way from the range of the tiger, with even the Siberian tiger being thousands and thousands of miles away. No matter how lost these creatures get, they are pretty much never going to meet in the wild. However, we do have plenty of records of their fights. During the California Gold Rush of the 19th century, prospectors would capture grizzlies and set them to fight against other animals. First up, they tried them out against bulls, but the bears would just club the bulls to death with their paws, and in a pretty short time. You have to remember that a grizzly can reach 10 feet in height and 1,500 pounds in weight. This is a monstrously strong animal whose claws are longer than human fingers. Then they shipped in lions from Africa to try and make a more interesting fight, but in spite of the ferocious attack of the lion, it didn't last much longer than the bull. Finally, they tried out a Siberian tiger, and even that could not withstand the mighty force of the grizzly's paws. There's just no match for a full-grown grizzly bear. Number 8. Jaguar 
Okay, so to begin with, if this is the biggest tiger versus the biggest jaguar, it's not really a fair fight. A full-grown Bengal tiger weighs more than twice as much as a jaguar, and that's not even the biggest of the tigers. But what if these two could go pound for pound? There's a species of tiger known as the Sumatran tiger, which is smaller than a Bengal. In fact, it's pretty much the same size as a jaguar. And this is where things get interesting for the jaguar. The tiger would be taller, have longer limbs, and a longer tail, meaning it has advantages in running. But in a fight, the jaguar has some strengths which could overwhelm the tiger. First, it has a larger muscle mass, meaning it would have the upper hand in any grappling, but the main strength of the jaguar is its bite, which is the most powerful of any cat. It can apply an incredible 1,300 psi with its jaws, which is twice that of the Sumatran tiger. Jaguars have the ability to bite through the skull of their enemies, and if it could get a hold of the tiger's head, then it would surely be victorious. Number 7. Monkey so, overpowering a tiger is one strategy to defeat them, but not the only strategy. There's a whole variety of ways you could at least try to defeat a tiger. One of the ways is just screw with their heads, torment them, annoy them, and show off how much smarter and more agile you are. And that's what this monkey decided to do one boring day in the jungle. Spotting a couple of tigers hanging around below his tree, the monkey decided to spice things up a bit and play chicken with them. He gives them a pinch on the ear, then a slap around the head before swinging off again, always just out of reach of the tigers. He even drops down onto the ground to give the tigers a chance, before skipping back up the tree again just when they're ready to pounce. He even gives them a whipping with a branch. This is one seriously cheeky monkey, he knows just how to evade them, but he must also know the consequences if he's caught. Sometimes they are agonizingly close, but the monkey won't give up. Just look at him pulling the tiger's tail. Being a mighty predator is all when and good, but brains and agility are the ultimate combination. Number 6. Alibi the alibi, also known as a Central Asian Shepherd Dog, is a massive breed of dog bred by the Soviet Union. That's right, this is a kind of badass, communist dog, bred for fighting capitalism maybe, but also for fighting each other and protecting livestock. They are descended from very ancient breeds of the region. But in this particular form, they are known for their incredible intelligence and massive strength. <laughs> with one of the strongest bite forces of any dog. They are also fearless and have the ability, like all dogs, to work well in a pack. So they have often been used to protect livestock from predators. And in Russia, this sometimes means tigers, who are native to the country. One dog alone against a tiger isn't going to be much of a fight, but the dogs have an advantage as a group of five or six animals against the solitary tiger. Tigers never work together, tending to be aggressive and territorial, around other tigers. But dogs are highly social animals. With huge intelligence, a pack of these dogs might just be enough to make a tiger flee and protect the precious livestock. Number 5. Crane well, we've had monkeys and pet dogs, so how about a kind of spindly flapping bag of bones and feathers? Can that defeat a tiger? The answer seems to be that it is not afraid to try, I guess. At a safari park in Zhejiang Province, China, visitors caught some video of a crane, which had fallen into pretty much the worst enclosure possible, the one full of tigers. Three of the huge cats approached, thinking they were in for a seriously easy meal. But in China, one of the most powerful forms of martial arts Arts is known as crane style. And it seems this bird was some kind of Shaolin master. Taking on one tiger would be enough, but having three on the run is seriously impressive. The crane spread its elegant wings and then went in with the beak. I would not have been surprised to see it pull out a set of nunchucks and leave all three of these big cats knocked out. Before long, the tigers make a run for it back to their inside rooms, and the crane is rescued by some zookeepers, who seemed not to be so afraid of this tiger terrorizing crane. Number 4. Harpy Eagle If a crane can manage all that, then how about the most powerful raptor in the rainforest? 
Harpy eagles are one of the largest eagles in the world. Their habitat ranges from Mexico to Brazil, although these birds are very rare. They are truly enormous and can weigh as much as 27 pounds, which is just crazy for a bird. They have the largest talons of any eagle and can lift full-grown sloths and howler monkeys without stopping flight. which is an amazing feat of strength. Of course, there are no tigers in the Amazon, but if they ever met, could a harpy eagle kill a tiger? Maybe not a full-grown adult, but golden eagles have been known to kill wolves, so it's not impossible to imagine a harpy eagle being able to use its huge claws to pierce the spinal cord of a young tiger. Either way, these eagles are seriously amazing hunters and are named after the ancient Greek mythological creature who had the head of a woman and the body of a vulture, and who caused the Greek hero no end of problems. So watch out for these monsters of the sky. Number 3. Hyena Tigers and hyenas live together in parts of Asia, specifically the striped hyena and the Bengal tiger. One on one, the striped hyena wouldn't stand a chance against a full-grown tiger. Even though they are seriously tough animals, they often meet at scavenging sites since the striped hyena is primarily a scavenger and will try to drive predators from their prey. Often this is successful, and a striped hyena can make leopards, caracals, cheetahs, and tiger cubs abandon their kill in fear. But not adult tigers. The hyena has some amazing advantages, including primate-level intelligence a massive heart, which is twice the size of a lion's, and a very high pain threshold. On top of that, their bite can inflict 1,000 psi of force, which is enough to crush elephant bones. The spotted hyena, native to Africa, has the same qualities, but is bigger and stronger. Also, the spotted hyena hunts 95% of its prey. If it lived in Asia, it would become the dominant predator, ahead of tigers. These animals can dominate lions and would have no trouble dominating a tiger too. Big cats have a much lower pain threshold than dogs, so one big bite might be enough to win it. But of course, their main advantage is that they work in a group, unlike the tiger. Number 2. Asian Black Bear the Asian black bear is the biggest bear in South Asia and is a serious fighting machine when it wants to be, especially if it's protecting its cubs. But in this video, the tables are turned as the bear finds itself up against two tiger cubs. At least that's what it thinks it's facing, because pretty quickly mom and dad show up and the young black bear has to contend with two full-grown adult tigers. And it does a pretty good job standing up and facing down the huge cats keeping his eyes on them at all times. Asian black bears are sometimes prey for tigers, but they are certainly not easy prey. Famous tiger hunter Jim Corbett recounted one episode where he saw an Asian black bear defeat a tiger in a fight, even if the bear had some serious wounds by the end of the fight. Siberian tigers are known to imitate the mating call of Asian black bears, luring them into a trap. But once in the trap, there is no guarantee that these huge bears won't find a way to fight their way past the tiger. Number 1. Water Buffalo Wild water buffalo have the largest horns of any buffalo, and you can see here that they are simply enormous. Only very brave or very stupid tigers would consider attacking an animal this large and one which has horns this big. In Assam in India, tiger carcasses have been found gored by wild water buffalo, proving that this buffalo is a serious fighter, and this was no baby tiger but an adult male Bengal tiger who had been a little too ambitious in selecting his lunch. Luckily for tigers, there are only about 3,500 of these monsters left in the wild, so the chances of running into one are pretty slim. Sometimes a tiger can take one of these down, but this is about as dangerous a meal as it gets, kind of like homemade fugu for tigers. One wrong cut, and you are dead meat. As we can see in this video, sometimes all it takes is just one look from the buffalo and the tiger is ready to back off. Funny how these mighty predators suddenly look like a terrified house cat when something this big stares them down. That's all the tiger fighting we have time for in this video. How about these crazy animals that could defeat tigers? Which one impressed you the most? Let us know in the comments below. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time.